God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. The shades of night descend, the dying of the daylight, the child's creation's end. Though noon gives place to sunset, yet dark gives place to light, the promise of tomorrow. With dawn's new hope is bright, so will the new creation rise from the old reborn to splendor in Christ's glory and everlasting morn. The darkness will be ended. As faith gives place to sight, a Father, Son, and Spirit, one God in heaven's light. Yours is more than mortal beauty. Every word you speak is full of grace. My heart overflows with noble words. To the king I must speak the song I have made, my tongue as nimble as the pen of a scribe. You are the fairest of the children of men, and graciousness is poured upon your lips, because God has blessed you for evermore. O mighty one, gird your sword upon your thigh. In splendor and state, ride on in triumph for the cause of truth and goodness and right. Take aim with your bow in your dread right hand. Your arrows are sharp. Peoples fall beneath you. The foes of the king fall down and lose heart. Your throne, O God, shall endure forever. A scepter of justice is the scepter of your kingdom. Your love is for justice, your hatred for evil. Therefore God, your God, has anointed you with the oil of gladness above other kings. Your robes are fragrant with aloes and myrrh. From the ivory palace you are greeted with music. The daughters of kings are among your loved ones. On your right stands the queen in gold of Ophir. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Yours is more than mortal beauty. Every word you speak is full of grace. The bridegroom is here. Go out and welcome him. Listen, O daughter, give ear to my words. Forget your own people and your father's house. So will the king desire your beauty. He is your lord. Pay homage to him. And the people of Tyre shall come with gifts. The richest of the people shall seek your favor. The daughter of the king is clothed with splendor, her robes embroidered with pearls set in gold. She is led to the king with her maiden companions. They are escorted amid gladness and joy. They pass within the palace of the king. Sons shall be yours in place of your fathers. You will make them princes over all the earth. May this song make your name forever remembered. May the peoples praise you from age to age. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. The bridegroom is here. Go, Go out, out and, and welcome, welcome him. God planned in the fullness of time to restore all things in Christ. Praised be the God and Father 
of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has bestowed on us in Christ every spiritual blessing in the heavens. God chose us in him before the world began to be holy and blameless in his sight. He predestined us to be his adopted sons through Jesus Christ. Such was his will and pleasure that all might praise the glorious favor he has bestowed on us in his beloved. In him and through his blood we have been redeemed and our sins forgiven. So immeasurably generous is God's favor to us. God has given us the wisdom to understand fully the mystery, the plan he was pleased to decree in Christ. A plan to be carried out in Christ in the fullness of time, to bring all things into one in him, in the heavens and on earth. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. God planned in, in the, the fullness, fullness of time, time to restore all things in Christ. We thank God constantly that in receiving his message from us, you took it not as the word of men, but as it truly is, the word of God at work within you who believe. Accept my prayer, O Lord, which rises up to you, Accept my prayer, O Lord, which rises up to you. Like burning incense in your sight, which rises up to you. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Accept my prayer, O Lord, which rises up to you. Forever will my soul proclaim the greatness of the Lord. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior, for he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm. He has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things, and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us praise Christ, who loves, nourishes, and supports his church. With faith, let us cry out to him. Answer the prayers of your people, Lord. Lord Jesus, grant that all men be saved and come to the knowledge of truth. Answer the prayers of your people, Lord. Preserve our Holy Father, Pope Francis, Frank, our Bishop of Sacred Beauty, and all of our diocesan bishops. Come with your power to help them. Answer the prayers of your people, Lord. 
Remember those who long for honest work, so that they may lead a life of peaceful security. Answer the prayers of your people, Lord. Lord, be the refuge of the poor, their help in distress. Answer the prayers of your people, Lord. We commend to your care all bishops, priests, and deacons who have died. May they sing your praises forever around your heavenly throne. Answer the prayers of your people, Lord. Our Father, who Who art in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Let us pray. Almighty Father, you have given us the strength to work throughout this day. Receive our evening sacrifice of praise in thanksgiving for your countless gifts. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God for ever and ever. Amen. May the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.